Hey there, it's now time to plant some brassicas. I got curly kale, cabbage, calabresa, Brussels sprouts, and some purple sprouting broccoli. So I've just gone over with a fork, just getting rid of all the clump and soil like that. So all you need to do, and now I'm going to create a nice fine tilt. Basically, start off just waiting long like that and then I'll show you how to make a nice finish to it. Now then to make it nice sorry about all the sheep or finding they've all lost their lambs probably. Anyway to make a nice finish just go across scraping along all the stones like this and bring it across like this very lightly getting the worst of the stones just pick out a few as you go along almost finished now just very lightly like that now, we're going to pick up that stone and we're going to go along using the back of the wake, just patting it down nicely like that so you can see some lines firming down the soil or the compost, whichever you use, it doesn't really matter. And the reason why we're planting five different types in this bed is because you don't plant brassicas in their final destination. Um, what you do, you just transplant them when they're ready. So, about when they're about three to, well, two to three inches high, you just want to transplant them out, and that will be another video. So this is basically part one. So now we've created a nice fine tilt. We're going to go along creating, just quickly get the hoe. Creating three rows about six inches apart from each other. It's very fine rows. Like that. Doesn't need to be very tidy or anything. Or finish, and I'll just do the other, the other two. Now I've just already planted the purple sprouting broccoli, and the way to plant brassicas is to just pick a few and go along the trench evenly thinly planting them out like that okay so that's what I'm gonna do now and I'm only gonna use half a packet we find that a whole packet lasts about two years Be careful now with the wind Bit more. there's about half a packet so remember so thinly like this Now. And just let me put a few more. And so there I planted the first one and when I've used one of the labels to mark out um, the middle so I don't get mixed up and sit them quite far away because of the birds to finish off just to give them to cover the rows over like this very thinly try not to get any stones on top like that 
and then give them a nice little water. And that's how you grow brassicas from seeds. And this is part one and part two. I'll show you hopefully um, how to transplant them. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you've learned something and I'll see you again with a new video. Bye.